Okay, two rewards available. I haven't been doing that yet. It says I finished that. Looks like, maybe, okay, maybe they're just a set of races, American pop culture. I thought I had this vehicle. Didn't I just win a Jeep? See, they want me to purchase. Oh, they have some speed traps. I mean, I don't want to spend the money just to, like, do it. The question is, is am I allowed to tune the Jeep up? I thought I unlocked... It's where it's like I have to purchase a bunch of vehicles to um, to do some of these missions. Yet I'm not really unlocking many vehicles. Other than the, the ones at the very end of let's say like the playlist. I thought I had this. I was going to do this next. I thought for sure because I was going to do this next so I now I have to see it I have to purchase a vehicle 200,000 200,000 wow just to like do this mission. Which I'm not sure how well this is gonna go. I think I'm already on it. A playlist is ready to try. Let's See, I bet it. this car has like drift wheels on it. See, this car has drift wheels or something. It's different. I can already tell. For a long time, drifting was illegal in Japan, the drift country of origin. The discipline has come a long way since then. It's now one of the most impressive kind of motorsports, taking place all over the world. It was illegal, huh? As 
usual, the motor best brings together the best and gives you the opportunity to compete against them. Shortcut. Contain a break before getting down to business. Hopefully, I make get my money back. I make enough money. It was like 200,000 at the end of this event. Rift experience. Yes, do where's this car? It's my favorite GTR. Where's the R33 at? They show it, yet I can't buy it. I don't get it. the next objective. from over there. Before letting you drift in the wild, the Motorfest invites you to try your hand burning rubber or professional track drifting. It's your chance to gain a little confidence. And you'll never slide alone either. Your host came to Hawaii with her crew to teach Japanese street racing. She's a lover of drifting and didn't want to leave without giving a little masterclass. See, this car can drift on its own. It must have certain tires that can do it. It's Hinata, one of the members of the pack from the Made in Japan playlist. If it doesn't ring a bell, well, you know what you could do. The playlist is there waiting for you. are individual scoring events and maximum points by drifting as long as possible Hinata might have a tip or two that you could use your coach is waiting for you at the drifting track of the festival the first of a series of three okay You 
made such a great impression with your Supra, Shingo even wanted to put the same dragon sticker on his NSX. Honestly, you should come and see his car. Otherwise, he might sulk. Okay, let's focus. As you know, drifting is a bit of a hobby of mine. My job is to coach you by sharing my favorite drills. It's gonna be so cool. My first piece of advice is simple. If you want to drift, just accelerate and drift. This may sound basic, but it's the key. Your Nismo is powerful enough to slide along on its own when you're at high speed, so don't be afraid to keep your foot on the gas. Once you start, the only challenge is managing your tire placement. Sharks too? Ugh, I'm gonna stay here forever. I don't know. Good job, driver. turbines definitely not your average drift experience you'll just have to slide and let the wind carry you while trying to maintain your drift combo of course going to be the M5 Drift Edition for you. It holds the world record for the longest drift, eight hours. No one's asking you to go that far, but going after the series record is clearly on the table. Track drifting session in sight. I'm fine. It's a heavy car. Wow, BMW, I love European cars, but I know almost nothing about them. Except that yours is a 953 horsepower front engine rear wheel drive car that supports its 1,848 kilo curb weight when it throws itself into a curve. Anyway. Wow, see this car does it better with the wet rain. Look at this. Holy crap! Wow! Wow! 
Wow. This is much better with the rain. Maybe it's the car? That's what I'm doing. Allows you to change direction quickly. Your turn. Wow. Uh, oh, this M5 is crazy. Wow. That was incredible. That was the best drifting I've done so far. I don't know if it was the rain or the M5. I don't know. The wet road or the M5. I don't know. I would have done better if I didn't switch to the inside... Um, the cockpit view but I want to see it from the inside so dude I want to build a drift car now man I want there's a s15 in the game or something specifically a drift car I think that's what you have to do like And you know, Need for Speed was like that. Need for Speed Heat were like, there were different tires and different differentials to make it where it was either more of a track car or an off-road or a drift car. So I think the next module is even crazier. I think it's a bit similar. Yeah, I want to build some cars, man. 
But I'm already seeing some cards that are missing from the game that I want to play. I don't know. There's hardly any B58 other than the Supra. It's interesting. Yeah, I have the Z4, but. That's a drift. Yeah. Oops. Wait a minute. Are you telling me they built a drift machine out of a DeLorean? Genius. No way I'm leaving this island without giving it a try. This place is wonderful. Okay, let me get myself together. Look at the boost up front. down back to the ground don't leave right. any points for the others after this you're off the beaten track and it's going to be even tougher Come on See, so I need to look for tires that say drift and suspension. So those are specific. Okay. And I think I'm just now unlocking these. Good job, driver. New challenges lie ahead. In fact, hold on. I hold on. I'm not gonna spend too much time here. But now that I am You see, like, where's all that other stuff at? Where's, hold on. Let's get... This is a specific car. Well, even this. I'm gonna see something. Let's go to tires. Where does it say? I 
I think you have to press inactive. I think most of these are, I think the blues mean something different from the pink color, violet color, and the green. See, I have too many. I've only been unlocking the special cars, you know? Hold on. So let me go to. Yeah, these are all special cars. I don't think you could do anything with them. So let me get my Z4 here. This may be the best option. See all this legendary stuff. That's fine. But so far, I haven't seen anything like turbos or anything like that. Maybe I haven't gotten to it. I did see an engine and the challenges that can, like a V8 engine. See, this says bend. It's like a motorcycle helmet. It says bend it. 10% skill. Like, I don't understand any of this. I don't. I don't know where else I can read about this. The stats. Well, there, but still. This says there's 1,000. I don't get it. Increase speed while ahead of a vehicle, but that's ridiculous. Trailer's ridiculous. So you just stay ahead. Okay. See, it says legendary tires, but... There are specific tires for, like... Like... Are all the greens for drifting? Are the blues for something else? I can't figure that out. That's what annoys me because I want to build certain vehicles. And I'm just not understanding it. Because I'm starting to think these are not all the same like I thought they were. Obviously reading the affixed stats like they're not the same. See, that one had no fixed stats. Air Nitro Power 0 0.9, okay. But again, I'm not understanding. This one has frenetic. I still don't understand, because you see, I am going to switch cars to, going back to my uh, G82 and 4 So like this, like, let's say I want to upgrade this right now. Like, what's the difference? Like, I could, you know, I could switch it to this right now. Like, because the, these are color coded. I know they are now. The greens are different from the blues. I think the greens are the drift. I don't know. So, let's drive. I know I'm talking a lot. Because I noticed in the event, dude, the color looks so messed up on the paint. It's not what I'm trying to go for.
time to put your new skills to the test for the most traditional drifting discipline. The next events are confrontations with nature. Two toge time attacks on winding volcanic roads. Freaking truck messed me up. How far is this? Wait a second. Uh, I think I'm gonna fly here. <laughs> I can go that high. You already know the Togi. You experienced it with the street racing car during your epic Made in Japan performance. But the game's changed. The Drift Experience series has its requirements, meaning that you can only drive a drift car, but certainly not a boring drift car. So the different drift, drift tires and the suspension are completely changed it for me. I need those in order to drift. Oh dude, here you go, Tokyo Drift. Not exactly the same Mustang, but... So let's get down to toge business. You have all the skills a pro drifter can have. Now it's about being thorough. Yeah, I couldn't do anything. See, this one's heavy. You've already beaten Hayato. What do you have to fear today? Sure, you were driving the best car in the world that night, my RX-7, but still, you were on fire. to anticipate the next move and not lose your combo. Yeah, see, this one's difficult to drift. This descent can be tricky. If you want my opinion, no need to look for the perfect drift. The faster you get to the finish line, the higher your score will be. To this car, I can't. They keep starting me off like that. Man. Yeah. 
Wow. See, that one wasn't good. The car is, is definitely completely different. That one felt heavy. Dude, the M5 was the best one so far. The M5 was the best one. You see how they're all green. That makes me think that the green products are all for drift. Well but, done. Let's move on to the following event. That's right over there. That makes me think that. You know, makes me think all the green. Hold on. There's still a scoring event to hit. After an old-fashioned ride, you might want to try a more recent car. It's a major Japanese supercar transformed into a super drifter. The Motorfest team's put a lot of work into it. Camber adjustment in the front, 200 kilos shaved off the scale, but above all, it has a 900 horsepower boost. 900 horsepower. One of the new monsters of the festival. Whoa. 2021 Toyota Super Drift. Oh, this time really? Is the end of the Toge segment, driver? Enjoy this last solitary moment. Oh. I like that they accept that the B58 can reach like a thousand horsepower. So they said this is 900 here. Oh, this is drifting. Same drifting song. Three minutes to make the best score. You know what to do. I'll let you handle it. And you can always count on my special move, the boogie drift of killing death. I don't know. As long as I beat it. No, one of the blue ones was drift there. Did I see that? I thought I saw the first one was blue and it says drift. I'm not sure. What a win! The best of many, I am sure. How far is this? Your opponents won't 
just be names on a board anymore. They're waiting for you on the grid with their street rides. Trust your new drifting skills. They will make the difference. That was it, no. the roads are wet see the maybe that was it with the m5 i don't know maybe it was the wet roads because i think the wet roads do make a difference it seems like in the game but the m5 that was dude i was just going crazy like i was having a good time with it is this a drift event or a race She is wet. I think the idea is that they give me drift tires. Trying to hold it together. Try. Left. Then right. Got it. Don't forget the nitro if you slip too hard. It'll straighten you out. I'm not gonna drift this one. 90 degree angle. Prepare to take the inside track. Mm 
Keep going. I did it. See you in the next episode, Bambini. All right. See the wet roads? That's when I can drift. The dry roads, I can't seem to do it. I have some epic drift. I don't know if that's above. I think legendary is above epic. No time to rest on your laurels. Keep going, driver. How far is it? Up there. Okay. Say GTR? No way. It's R34 and it looks cool. Wow. Dude, I want the R33. Is that? Robocop? Uh, um. Not Robocop. Mega Man? Gundam? Oh, yeah, it's a drifting car. Holy crap. Let me retry. I forgot it's a drifting car. So, that's the other thing. Since it's a race, the drifting does make it more difficult to race. And obviously the computer's not going to struggle with that.
nostalgic for our wangin' moment. Cool, you already know the car. But this one, what style? You're giving the competition a real fashion lesson. When you manage to drip this bulky bodywork, it's just magic. I like this. Come on. Once I figure out the drifting, the tire situation, I'm gonna make entire videos dedicated to it, I swear. This is cool. I'm starting to like the drifting better than Need for Speed. The problem is you have to figure out the, the tires and the suspension in order to get it to drift like this. Yeah, that's crazy. That's insane. The drift setup on the car completely changes it. It slides no matter what. Oh, there's an Infinity Q60. It slides no matter what. Wow. So now I can build some drift cars if I can figure it out. See, those are all green. But that's blue. And it said drift. You see what I'm saying? Great job, but the journey is far from over. Epilogue time. If you want to train one last time, follow Waimea Valley. The mountain road will take you to the climax. See this? I can't drift. It's not meant to drift. And it's supposed to be all wheel drive, technically. This might be my first RX-7. I think it is. Let's try to make it good. 
It's another race. The Viper, I'm definitely faster. Seven. I think that the bird is ready to leave its nest. What more can I say? Well, maybe one thing. Show these guys what a true drifter is. Dude, this is BS. Where do you come from? No. He screwed me up. Where did he come from? Yeah, right. I gotta catch up. I can still catch up. No, I'm just going through it. Bye. I was just being careful right there, just go through it. See, this car handles better as a slightly drift car. Final stretch. Give it everything. Oh. Yeah, that's the last one, 80,000.
a reward vehicle waiting for you. See you. Oh, yeah. This series is coming to an end. How far is it? It looks pretty far. Let me see. I'll get there quick, watch. It was so cool to see you get stronger as the playlist went on. You can be proud. Drifting is a discipline of precision. Winning an event is tough. So winning a whole playlist, it's more than just dumb luck. I didn't even see you move. Well, you've taken up the challenge. Now it's up to us to keep our promise. The Toyota Supra Drift Edition you got to know in the volcano is waiting for you. There's a Super Drift Edition, okay. Playlist Ocean and Sky. Good choice. Ready to go? Not yet. So, stop this one here. I'm you see the vehicle says drift at the top right see that's different now why does it say drift that says rally raid. Street tier two. I don't have anything that says like full track or anything. So that's interesting. Right. You can filter. It's a street one to you. That's interesting. Huh. It's just like they've already decided what's classified. I don't know.
And yeah, this is my starter car here. Right? But it still says street tier. See, I'm still like... I still want to figure that out. Maybe this. You see how I don't have there's there's no other options for like tires. See nitros. I knew there would be something for those. Window tent. You know what it is though. I'm thinking. I think I get these in the challenges. Maybe. I have no idea. Anyway. Go ahead and end this one. Start on the next one. It's 319 AM right now, but let's do it.